Hey everyone, welcome back to Scoop Hash. Shane here, and today I want to talk about the issue of bots. Now, I don't mean those bots that keep messaging you on Tinder, asking you to visit their website all while telling you how lonely they are. No, those are a different type than what I am talking about. I'm talking about those GD bots that are taking up all the PS5s, all the Xboxes online right now, as more and more players are left without a console of their own. Now, first and foremost, I just want to be up front and say that I did get a PS5, as many of you know. I was able to get a pre-order on the day they were announced. I'm very lucky to have gotten one, and I do feel for those of you who have had zero luck so far in trying to find one. Bots are essentially programs used by scalpers to buy out as many of a certain item as possible in order to then turn that item around and sell it for an insane amount of money. It happens with concert tickets, game consoles, iPhones, anything really. And it's a fucking problem. I've been, have, I've been trying to help some friends in getting a console several times now, through the Walmart restocks, online marketplaces, and more. But just today, Walmart had a restock go live at around 1 o'clock Mountain Standard Time, and I was there, a good amount of time before the actual release of the restock, ready to go. And you know what happened? Bots. The console sold out in minutes, maybe even seconds. I don't know if quite, you know, how long it was. The site was literally collapsing in front of my eyes while I was trying to manage and try to find one. This also happened last week when Walmart had three different restock times go live. It happened on the initial day of pre-orders as well, when players first tried to get a console. They got swept up instantly, and now they are sitting on sites like eBay or Craigslist going for prices of above $1,000. I mean, go look at the prices yourself. They're insane. I've seen some people asking for $5,000 just for a PS5. And they know that people will buy them because the production of the consoles is low enough and people are desperate enough. It's your classic supply and demand scenario and these scalp scalpers are abusing it for their own benefit. The problem is that I don't know what the solution is. Ideally, I would say that Sony, Microsoft, and all these retailers need to have systems in place to avoid bots and scalpers, but I don't know what that could look like. That is so far out of my domain and I don't even want to pretend like I know what I'm talking about. Now when I was at Walmart today, they did have a new CAPTCHA system in place and I tried to add the console to my cart that wasn't in place last week. The problem was that every time I would finish the CAPTCHA, it would make me take another one. And another one. I seriously must have done 20 captures just trying to add this damn console to my cart, and none of them registered. I would guess that it was due to the high traffic going on the website and causing these problems at the time, but it was still frustrating to experience. And I was talking to another friend who was on trying to get one as well, and they said they didn't have any capture come up. So I can even say for sure that it was a purposeful measure to counteract bots. Maybe the website was just freaking out on me. I just feel for those players out there who have tried so hard to find a console and have been absolutely fucked by scalpers. This is a brand new console generation and it should be an exciting time for gamers to share in. But there's so many being left out in the dark because of this shit. It's so frustrating to watch and given that production has slowed down because of the pandemic, it just makes it all so much worse. Look, if you're looking to get your hands on a console still, don't give up. There will be more opportunities and more supply coming. And please do not give in to the scalpers. Do not pay these exorbitant amounts, absurd prices. It's just not worth it. And for any of you who are one of those people posting their pictures on these resale sites of their mountains of consoles waiting to be bought, fuck you. If you enjoyed this video, please leave it a like, subscribe to our channel, and share it with everyone you know and even those you don't. Thanks for watching and being a part of this community, and for all your gaming news and more, be sure to check back in here with Scoop Hatch.